So Michael Moore has stooped to uh, another low. Fox News is not the most reputable source uh, because I, I really can't stand Fox News because of a lot of their bullcrap. But I hate to say this, but uh, they're actually more trustworthy than anything else right now, even though I can't stand uh, Fox News. And they reported uh, this. Uh, Michael Moore calls for protesters to disrupt Trump's inauguration. <sighs> the the guy hasn't even done anything yet. The guy isn't even president yet. And you should disrupt uh, him. Jesus fucking Christ. Um, give the... Like, I would at least give him a year or something... And then, and or, or six months, at least give him some time to actually achieve something. And if if he fucks up, go right after him. I would, I would, uh, I would. Uh, I'm probably gonna do videos on, on uh, what he's uh, uh, doing after he gets uh, uh, inaugurated as president. But right now, he hasn't done anything. He hasn't done any. Uh, he's not implemented any policies. I even saw an article where Obama said he liked uh, Donald Trump uh, having the conversations with him. Um, and Michael Moore is in this uh, in this mindset that, yeah, all the um, all the uh, protests, so to speak, the riots afterwards are are a good thing afterwards. And now wants to disrupt also the inauguration. This is stupid as hell. <sighs> Let's dive into this. Michael Moore, who predicted Donald Trump would win the presidency months before his surprise victory, uh, is now encouraging people to protest the president-elect's upcoming in inauguration. Disrupting inauguration, the majority have spoken by nearly 2.7 million votes and counting. Silence is not an option, Moore tweeted Wednesday. The liberal filmmaker shared a, a link to the website Disrupt, J20, a campaign uh, a, for a bold mobilization against the inauguration of Donald Trump on January 20th, 2017. Jesus Christ. <sighs> the website states, we call on all people of good conscience to join in on disrupting the ceremony. <sighs> Look, again... Why would you d d try to disrupt? You're you're uh, uh, advocating for uh, public, uh, uh, basically, p uh, people disrupting in uh, in the public, uh, uh, and you might even in incite violence uh, uh, with uh, w when you do this ty type of stuff. Uh, what is this? Is the SJW mindset? It's okay when we do it. What the hell? If Trump is to be inaugurated at all, let it happen behind closed doors. Okay, so uh, Trump is different because why? So, so uh, inaugurating every single uh, president before this day uh, and this year uh, has been okay to be in the open. But now because it's Trump, it's someone you don't like. Uh, you should do the uh, do it be behind closed doors. That makes no sense at all. <sighs> Showing the true face of the security state Trump will preside over. It must be made clear to the whole world that the mass majority of people in the United States do not support his uh, president or consent to his rule. Wrong. Um... Uh, f uh, like half of the country did not even vote in this election and you have uh, the people who uh, who voted uh, uh, who are the biggest cities like uh, or the highly dense uh, areas like New York, sh Chicago and I believe California uh, those areas uh, uh, voted heavily for uh, Hillary Clinton, which means she got a lot of votes. But that's not how your republic works. That's how not uh, not how you set up your uh, 
your uh, republic and, and the the electoral college in uh, in the United States. You just have to face it. And seeing it's the vast majority of people, that's a lie because you have uh, almost half of the voters who voted Trump, which made him president, plus uh, almost like that makes almost 75% of the country that uh, uh, either have uh, no no sway either way or uh, voted for Trump. So it's not a vast majority. It, you're actually in the minority here. Disrupt uh, J20 is planning DC-based protests on the day of Trump's inauguration. We'll also ask people to protest on the streets wherever you are. And here we go. The social justice organization also calls for worldwide action. <sighs> this reeks of entitlement. I'm not uh, gonna uh, uh, go out in the streets just because you're buttered or over the results of your election. Jesus Christ. Fuck off. Like, really, fuck off. I'm not gonna... Uh, 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 protest some shit that happened in in one country when there are uh, over uh, uh, close to 200 countries uh, around the world that uh, have their own problems like fuck off uh, Michael Moore if you're living outside the US you can take action out uh, at US embassies borders or other symbols of neo colonial power yeah fuck off again Neo-colonial power. What colonies do, uh, does the U.S. preside over except for their own country? Like, there are no colonies that the uh, U.S. Have, uh, ha have power over. Our religions is not to make America great again, but to all of humanity and the planet. Yeah, speak here for yourself and fuck right off.